Hey, 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 YouTube. It's Monday. Do you know what Monday means? Monday means legends! Legendary Monday! I officially decided to change the name over. So, Legendary Monday. Legendary Monday today talks about flight. There are so many songs written about flight, like... You're so high, high, high above me. Reach up for the sunrise. Put your hands in to the big sky. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. And today, our legendary Monday, we're going to talk about flight. In particular, we're going to look at the legend of Icarus and Daedalus. Icarus and Daedalus is one of those capstone legends or myths from Greek mythology. Because, because of how intricately it deals with Greek history, period, and it, it goes into some other legends. So, Icarus and Daedalus. Icarus is this master builder, this master engineer, this brilliant mind from mainland Greece. Ancient Grecian times. King Minos, the king of Crete, which is an island, off the south of Greece in the Mediterranean Sea, had his own kingdom at that time. So the king of Crete sent for Icarus and Daedalus from the mainland to come and build something for him. Didn't tell him what it was, really. What it was was the labyrinth historical habitat of the other other legendary character here, the Minotaur. But we're not going to talk about that because that's a different legend. Icarus comes and brings his son, Daedalus, in case you're wondering how he fit into any of this whatsoever. And Icarus builds this labyrinth for him. And then once he finds out what it is, he says, oh my goodness, because this Minotaur is going to kill children and people and that's bad! That's bad! How can that be good besides for King Minus? And so he decides he wants to go back to mainland Greece, take the next ship as soon as possible, and warn people in mainland Greece to not come and see King Minus at all. And of course King Minus is all like, Psh, you are not spoiling my secret, boy. And so he detains him, essentially. He puts him under house arrest. And so Icarus and his son Daedalus are in a castle tower, chillin'. They can have whatever they want. I mean, he built them the labyrinth, for goodness sakes. But they just can't leave. Kinda sucks. So while they're chillin', Daedalus, Icarus is like, we have to leave. We have to leave? We have to tell these people that they have to never come here. Daedalus is like, hey, I'm chillin'. It's a nice time. What do we gotta leave? totally doesn't understand it. He's like, besides, how can we leave? Can we just build, can we have wings like these birds, these seagulls that are pecking feed? And Icarus doesn't say anything. Not a single thing. Because he's thinking. These crazy engineers, they, they be thinking. And so, from every bird that comes to peck seed from their windowsill, Icarus takes a feather. Or two, or three. And at night, he takes candles and he melts them down and puts the feathers together with the wax to make wings. One pair for him, and one pair for his son. And one morning, he wakes up Daedalus early and says, All right, son, time to go. The son's like, What? What are you talking about? Where are we going? He's like, Oh, we're going back to Greece. It's like, oh, how? And he pulls out the wings. So they strap the wings out, they jump out of the castle, and Daedalus is sure he's gonna die. And then he doesn't, because it's a legend. <laughs> and, um, and they fly away. So as they're over the Mediterranean Sea, Icarus is flying, says to his son, don't fly too high. That's the one thing he says, don't fly too high. And so what does he do? Seagulls are bugging Daedalus. Daedalus is like, ha ah, ha I can fly higher than you. And he goes up higher. But it's such a nice day. It's such a nice day that the sun melts the wax on his wings and his wings fall apart. And he falls into the ocean and dies. And that is Legendary Monday. I'll see you tomorrow.